comfortable afternoon's work for you in the end? Yeah, it was, Paul. It was. Um, we dominated the game from, from start to finish. Could have had a few goals in the first half. Unlucky not to have a few goals. Their keepers kept them in the game. and The, the difference with the second half was we took our chances. Played a patient game, took our chances and came away with a few goals. It was a good, good day at the office. Is that just a bit of rustiness in the first half? Well, a little bit of ru rustiness and a little bit of eagerness as well. We were giving the ball away a little bit and a little bit of individual play here and there instead of you know, instead of just keeping the ball and, and recycling it and, and switching the play and getting the ball back in the box. So we, were we were just a bit too keen to, to get a goal and to get going. And once we calmed things down and, and we, got the, we got a goal, then it was... Uh, you know, it was a little bit easier after that. And uh, getting the second one immediately after half time is going to put yeah, they've cut it. the fight from them at all, isn't it? Yeah, totally, totally, Paul. It was uh, the first goal was important, and that second goal I think just really killed the game. Then and we relaxed, and uh, the game opened up, and we we just started to exert our domination over them. It was uh, yeah, a good a good good day for us, a really good day. Nice for Steve Jones uh, scoring two on his third debut for yeah. the club. Yeah, definitely. Nice to have Jonesy back. Nice for him to score a couple of goals as well, and he he, he played well. Yeah, there was there was no real like individual stars today. It was a good, just a good team performance, and uh, we worked hard. And you know, you can easily switch off in these games, and everyone goes gung ho and tries to get you know everyone's trying to get on the score sheet. But we maintained our discipline, especially in the second half, and put in a good performance and. Uh, came away with the three points and, the, and some nice goals as well. The, the back four as well, they kept their discipline uh, even considering they didn't have that much to do. Yeah, yeah, I was talking to, to Jack after the game there and you know th these kind of games are quite difficult when you've not got a lot to do and there's only one man up and sometimes you can switch off and lose your concentration and you know especially at 2-0, 3-0 they get a goal back, they get a bit of momentum and it's, it's a dangerous game then but yeah we kept our discipline kept switched on, kept focused and uh, got the rewards. And take this performance into Tuesday night against St Helens Town? Definitely, yep, definitely. That'll be a bit of a local derby. Um, I don't know how they've got on today, but we need to keep uh, we need to keep this momentum going. That's three wins out of three. Um, see where that takes us. You turned out to be uh, as much of a spectator as the, those that pay to get in today. Yeah, I don't know. It was... Um Unfortunately, it didn't have much to do, but good win for the lads, so I don't mind standing there cold if we, as long as we win. Uh, good performance by the team throughout. Yeah, yeah, um, you can only beat what's in front of you, but I thought the lads were brilliant today and helped our goal difference immensely, like, so well done to the boys. Was there any frustration at half-time in the dressing room that you didn't take your chances in the first half? Yeah, well, there obviously was, because we should have been, like, four or five up and... 1 0 is not good enough going in at half time, but I thought um, we adapted well in the second half, and 6 0 was just. Once you got that second one, then the dominance really showed, didn't it? Yeah, not half. Um, we just went on from strength to strength after the second. The early goal helped, and I thought we kicked on well from then, and 6 0 could have been 8 or 10, so um, not surprised it ends up 6 0 by the final whistle. And uh, important for the, the team that you put in two good performances against Bootsland and Stockport Sports and then build on a build on that and get the result today? Yeah, well, well this side's got a lot of potential and I really think we can go on an um, 8-10 to 10 to even 12 game run without getting beaten. This is a third, so we've got two winnable games Tuesday and um, Saturday, so just kick on from there, hopefully get two wins and march up the table. And, uh, two two clean sheets in a row for you. Must be pleasing. Yeah, it is. It's pleasing. Like and um, you know, obviously for the goalkeeper, a clean sheet's the main priority. And um, as long as we win as well, that helps a lot as well. So two wins on the bounce. So excellent. Congratulations today, and uh, hope you don't have that much to do again on Tuesday. No, I oh, know. Yeah, hopefully my hands are a bit cold, but hopefully I'll keep another clean sheet Tuesday and help the team. Can't really ask much more from an afternoon's work, can you? No, uh, today was all about being a little bit patient. We get frustrated early doors, uh, and it was a nice time to score the first goal um, just before the half hour. But to come away from, from home anywhere at any stand and score six goals, you've got to be pleased. Uh, we've dominated throughout. Uh, people might like say, well, they're bottom of the league and this, that and the other. I don't care. I've been there at the end of the day, and, and, and you've got to win games like this if you want to progress.
Uh, we come here last year and we got B4-0 and we dominated the game like we did today, but today we've took our chances when they come. And I thought once we got a, uh, a real foothold on, on, on the game, uh, there was only going to be one winner. Uh, comfortable as it was, uh, we still looked to score more goals when we played when we had to play and it was, a, it was enjoyable for the lads to play there today. Uh, first two goals, you got them in important times just before half time and then immediately after. Yeah, I mean, like like I said, I mean, again, with, with not having games, uh, you still got that bit of rustiness in. And just said to the lads at half time, it's uh, really it's just about being patient. Uh, you don't have to force the issue. Things will happen. We'll get our goals uh, when we get our chances because we created enough chances, especially first half. Uh, their keepers made a few good saves. Uh, few of it, um, but at the end of the day, you know, we've got the three points, that's most important. Uh, still made a, made a professional performance out of it though, didn't he? Yeah, I mean, you know, I, I said to the lads, as we, you know, as we scored three quick goals or four uh, quick goals in the second half, it's about now being professional, keeping your shape and your discipline, you know, and, and, and keep a clean sheet, uh, because if you start doing things like that, you start doing the proper things at the right times, when games are a little bit tighter, so it was, that was the pleasing point. Uh, that will keep another clean sheet, which is two on the trot now, so it's pleasing. And uh, <clears throat> after two good wins against two decent sides, then to put a performance in like that today must be pleasing for you. Yeah, I mean, you know, whoever we play today, you know, you're always looking to take your three points, but in the manner that they performed, uh, the way they did, and uh, the way they've kept the, prof the, pe the professionalism, if you like, uh, it's very pleasing. Um, and we scored some decent goals today, some of the movements and passing was uh, excellent. Uh, build on this for Tuesday afternoon, uh, Tuesday evening. Uh, hopefully, uh, it's another game. You know, like I said, you, you know, you take one. It's the old cliche, like I've said before, it's just one game at a time. We've got another game Tuesday, uh, and, and and hopefully we get the same type of performance. Uh, depending on what the weather's like, going to be in Prescott. <laughs> be a bit of a shock for the team, won't it? Uh, two games in three days rather than in three games in two months. Yeah, uh, I've just had a little word with them about uh, looking after themselves over the weekend, um, but you know. Uh, they'll, they'll just enjoy this evening and then uh, back down to the, the old chalkboard on on Tuesday night and hopefully we get the uh, same response out of the players, uh, same type of performance and uh, hopefully a decent win. Okay. Congratulations, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Are you cold? <laughs> just a touch. <laughs>